my beautiful little unicorns and welcome back to my channel. If this is the first time that I have the pleasure to welcome you on my channel, I'm Vanessa Samina and welcome to the fam. So you guys, today I have a really quick video on intuition and what intuition really feels like. So when it comes to spirituality, when it comes to pick a card readings and everything of that genre, we talk about intuition quite a bit. And I wanted to talk to you guys about what intuition really feels like and how you can figure out when your intuition is speaking to you. Intuition is kind of something really subjective, so it's something that is different for everyone. So the way I feel intuitively and the signs that my intuition gives me may be completely different from the way intuition speaks to you. But one thing that intuition really has in common is the fact that it's never really quite in your face. It's very subtle and you sort of need to understand the language of your personal intuition in order to know what your intuition is really trying to tell you. So your intuition can speak to you either physically or sort of like mentally. So what do I mean by that? If it speaks to you more in your head, you may see things like flashes of light, you may hear like a little voice or you may feel like you're getting a message or like you can even have a conversation with your intuition. So if you're in a situation where you can either see this flashing light or you can feel that you can ask something that is not you, but something else you can ask like, hey, what do you think I should do in this situation? And you feel like you would get a feeling back as an answer, then that is your intuition speaking. So you know, thoughts, words, etc., that pop into your mind in certain situations that you're unsure of, that sort of like have the ability to guide you to a certain decision, that is your intuition. And on the other hand, there are a lot of people who experience physical sensations. So for instance, if your tummy starts to feel really uneasy, you have like a feeling in your gut, that's why we also call it gut feeling, or you may feel like a tingling sensation on yourself, maybe even goosebumps. Your intuition could even be trying to guide you through giving you like a funny taste in your mouth or giving you a sensation where you feel like prickling like on your brain almost. So that is your intuition speaking to you, trying to guide you. So you may have a combination of all of these things. You may just have, you know, more physical sensations or you may have more of a voice talking to you or like a light that you see whenever you feel like your intuition is trying to communicate with you. Either way, if you don't recognize when your intuition is speaking to you, then it's really difficult to make use of it. So definitely make sure that you tune into your body and that you tune into what sort of sensations you experience when you're thinking of intuition and when you're in a situation where you need guidance and you want to hear what your intuition has to say. So keep in mind that intuition can be sometimes just a really deep knowing, a feeling that you know exactly what to do. That is also your gut feeling, that is also your intuition, and that is just as valid, obviously, as having goosebumps or your tummy all of a sudden feeling upset when it comes to making a decision. So know that if those are sensations, if those are things that you have felt before, especially in situations where you felt like you needed guidance and you weren't sure what to do, chances are those were messages from your intuition and that is how your intuition has tried to get in touch with you. That is it for my little bite-sized video for today. I hope you found it interesting and I hope it really made you think and get a better understanding of what your intuition may feel like. And yeah, I will see you in my next video. Bye!